In this video, I am going to show you how to share only one tab with another user in Google Sheets. So sometimes when you're working in Google Sheets, you may want to share a single sheet with another user without sharing all of the sheets or all of the tabs in your spreadsheet with that other user. So there isn't really a built-in way to do this in Google Sheets, but there is a workaround method that we can do using the import range function. So in this spreadsheet, I have these four tabs here. And what I want to do is I only want to share this tab with another user, just report to. So I can't share this file with them because otherwise the user will have access to all of the tabs. So what I want to do actually is I am going to have a new spreadsheet where I'm going to import this tab into the new spreadsheet and then I will only share this sheet with another user. And that is how we're gonna accomplish this. So to do this, first let's go back to the sheet that you wanna share with another user and then you're gonna copy the spreadsheet URL. So that is just going to be this part of the URL here in the top. So I'm going to copy that and then I have a new spreadsheet. Um, so you have a new spreadsheet open and then what we are going to do here is the import range function. So equals import range. And so the first argument of this function is going to be what we just copied and you want to make sure to put it inside quotation marks. So I have the spreadsheet URL of what I want to import inside quotation marks. Now the next argument of this function is just um, the range of data from this um, URL that I want to import. So in this example, it's going to be comma. So inside quotation marks, we're going to do report dash two because I'm taking this sheet and then we're gonna do columns A through T because that is where my data is. So report dash two and then exclamation A through T and then closing quotation marks and I'll put my closing parentheses and then press enter. Now, if your sheets have never been linked before, um, when you do this formula, you're gonna get this reference error. And you can see when I hover over it, it says you need to connect these sheets, allow access. So you wanna click allow access. And then you should see that after it adds these permissions here, that all of your data just loaded. And so now what we can do is file, share, and then from here, you can enter the email address of who you want to share with and send them access. And then they will only have access to this new spreadsheet with the single tab, and they will not have access to the original that has multiple tabs. So that is a workaround method um, for sharing a single sheet with another user in Google Sheets. Another option, is what you can do is for all of the other tabs here if you don't want them to have access to them um, you can create what's called protected ranges in your spreadsheet so if you want them to still be able to view the data but not edit it you can create protected ranges in all of these other tabs and then if you want them to be able to edit this tab you will just not have a protected range on that tab um, that's another option but if you don't even want them to be able to see the other tabs here, uh, this option, importing it into a new sheet and sharing the new sheet with them is a better option. So hopefully you followed along with all that. Um, if you have any questions, just let me. Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer everyone.